All right, let's see what we got here. I got two Allens holding this uh, instrument cluster in. So let's take those out and see Yeah, they're not very tight, I hope. What we can pull out of there. I don't know if any of the wires are hooked up in the... Yeah, I think they are. They're all hooked up inside the headlight shell. So we'll need to take those all apart. This is supposed to be a M6 with a hex head. But I put Allen's in there because that's what I had at the time. I didn't have any extra um, things like that. And I could go down to the local hardware store and buy them for exorbitant prices. But I didn't want to do that. So I finally found a place online where I could get what I wanted. And so I now have boxes full of them hex head and JIS head. The only problem with the JIS heads that I got is the head's bigger around than uh, the ones you normally find here. So sometimes it makes it a little problem. I don't guess I'd need to use JIS heads because just looking at the head, you can't tell it from a Phillips. Only your screwdriver can tell. But then if I put didn't put JIS, everybody would be using the wrong screwdriver again. I guess that makes sense. Man, how long did I put this screw in there? There it is, finally. Okay. That relieves the instrument cluster, but unfortunately, oh, camera's not pointing in the right direction anymore. <laughs> Let's see what we can do. We're up working front now. How about this one? This ain't either. Is it still working? I don't know. I can't tell. I don't think so. Maybe it was never working. Keep stopping my ears warm. All right. What's next? Bird shit. We can remove some bird shit. Over here, we need to take these off. looks like a new cable. I think it must be. So that goes through there. Well, where's the you dummy? You got it in your hand. Alright. Alright, so what do I think here? These these are tens. Let me see if I can get up there with this. Yeah, 
<laughs> I can get up there, but I can't get back out. I think if I remember correctly, this headlight rim is not fastened on, but maybe it is. Yeah. I wonder where the screw is. Is it over here? Yep. Looks like it's probably a JIS or a Phillips. It may be. Oh! There it goes. <laughs> Alright, we can take this apart now. Let's take the headlight off. I don't know if I've got another headlight rim or not, but this one's kind of bent. Be nice if I did, but I don't know. Alright, I need to put that screw back in there. All right, you're still recording up there? Yeah. Okay. Now, do we have the uh, tack? Tack is connected. I don't know if I tested this tack and speedo or not. Tack's off, the speedo wasn't connected. But the lights will be, I think. They go in here, I believe. And I'm going to have to take all this apart. And there is that part. Let's see if I can slice my finger off here. Use a sharp knife for something that wasn't ever meant to be used for. No, nope, I'm not going to do that. That's going to slip. And I do keep my pocket knife pretty sharp, so. There we go. One each wiring harness complete. All right, what do we got here? Speedo and tack and ignition key complete. Getting there. This is left handle controls, but it isn't the one that belongs on this bike, so I may see if I can find another better one. I don't think it is. It's black plastic, which I don't believe it would have been. I think it would have been aluminum. Okay. What do we got next? All right, let's take the um, turn signals off. Back to a JIS.
the old shit sucks. All right, there's one. All right, let's see if we can get the other one off. Turn signal number two. All right, let's see. Those come off. I'll probably put new ones on of those. Looks like I might need to get a new handlebar, a set of handlebars too. Uh, what else? Well, that finishes up the work I did yesterday. Um, I'm going to get at it again today and add some more stuff. Or take, take off some more stuff, actually. And uh, then I'll start, once I get everything off, I'll start uh, looking at the different components and, and doing what I can to refurbish the, the pieces uh, before I start putting everything back together again. So it's going to be a long process, and uh, I'm, I'm figuring three to four months before I actually get this thing back together. So bear with us and keep watching. Uh, please like and subscribe if you would like to, and uh, hit the little bell so you'll be notified when I put the next one up. Thanks much for watching. I appreciate it.